What's going on guys, Rob Chow the Tech Guy here and today I'm bringing you a tutorial on how to run the Hirons Boot CD from a USB. Now you're going to need two things. The first one, you're going to have to download the Hirons Boot CD ISO image and you're going to want to go to HironsBootCD.org. I will have links to these in the description. And you're going to come down here and just click this link right here and you will need WinRAR to unzip the files just to let you know. The second thing you're going to need is the Rufus bootable USB drive and basically come down here and click the Rufus 1.4.10 download link and yeah that's basically the only two things you'll need. Once you've got those what you're going to do for the Hirons Boot CD is unzip it. It will be in a uh, RAR file, so just in unzip that and you'll get a whole bunch of different things in here. But first what you want to do is go ahead and open Rufus and run as administrator. Once it's open, go ahead plug in your USB. As you can see, my USB is in the J drive just to make sure there it is, the J drive, because you don't want to reformat any other uh, drive. For the partition, sheem, and target system type, just keep all of it default. Most of the stuff just stays default. So file system, FAT32. For the formatting options, what the only thing you need to change is the bootable disk using, as you can see right here, it says FreeDOS. Change that to ISO image. Now, from the Hirons Disk CD image that you downloaded, you will get an ISO file. And what you want to do is go ahead and wherever you extracted it, open it up and choose the ISO file. Now, once you've done that, just go ahead and start it. And it will give you a little warning saying you all the content on the USB will be destroyed. So just make sure you've moved all of it off of it just so you don't lose anything. Now go ahead and hit start and what this will do is basically copy the image from the Hirons boot CD onto your USB. And yeah, I'll get back to you guys once this has completed. Alright guys, once it has copied all of the ISO files to your USB, you are pretty much done. Just go ahead and close this and navigate to your USB. And as you can see, it has all these different options. To get to the actual Hirons Boot CD menu, just open up the HBCD folder and choose the HBCD menu and run it as administrator and you are basically golden. This thing has a lot of cool features and yeah, if this video helped you out in any way then be sure to drop a like and I will see you guys in the next video.